Well, all's not lost with my meter. Um, I made a mistake by leaving F1 and F2 at the same setting, effectively shorting them out. And uh, we were wondering if the Syncor CR70 got damaged. Well, uh, just as an experiment now, I have this thing set up within a universal adapter to my digital voltmeter because I can't trust this meter. And as you can see, as I adjust the filament set, it seems to be working fine. So that's good. So it's not burnt out as far as I can tell right now. Um, so uh, it's still worth for me to try to find a replacement meter. You can see is when I'm adjusting the filament set, matter of fact, yeah, when I adjust this, you can see the meter doesn't do anything. I dropped it down all the way, now I'm raising it all the way. Sometimes if I bang it, see, it jumped a little bit. So the meter still is bad. Uh, what I would like is input from all of you. Um, in the manual, in this manual here, it states that this meter runs at 100 microamps at 4,000 ohms with a 2% tolerance. Anybody who really knows about meter movements, can you tell me if I get a modern one or replacement one that has the same specs, will it work with this? What I'm thinking about is what I can do is, like for instance, set this at 6.3 volts and put the new meter in. Um, kind of put this dial face, I mean the printed part, over the new meter, sandwich it in, and then adjust this just like I did to 6.3 volts, and then have it line up with the 6.3 volts on this scale here with the new meter. And then keep doing that, change the voltage see if the digital voltmeter adjusts with the meter. This this makes sense to me. Now, if all coincide with each other, I would think that it would be a pretty reasonable and reliable new meter to use. Um, I could use your in input on that, because I don't know. But to me, that makes logical sense. And that's one way to verify it, too. Just to use the filament set with my digital voltmeter, the new meter with this old dial, um, printed dial, um, sandwiched underneath and between the needle and the, and the back plate. And, um, and then if it all works out, then jury rig it in here, glue it down so it doesn't budge. And hopefully this thing is reliable and I can use it like normal. So uh, please give me your input on this. Uh, I could use some help. Thank you. Thanks for watching.